If you round up all avid Netflix fans and ask them what's their favorite science fiction show on Netflix, the numbers for Stranger Things will surely break records. Stranger Things is an American science fiction slash horror series created by the Duffer Brothers and is streaming on the giant platform Netflix. Since its first episode, released in July 2016, people were quickly hooked, and this specific series fan base spread across the globe, even non-fans of fiction and thriller. The story follows a young girl who has been the subject of experiments by the military, and was a key factor in helping her friends in danger after one boy vanished into the Upside Down. The story was set in the 1980s inside the fictional town of Hawkins, Indiana, and this alone gives fans the elements perfect for an eerily creepy yet attention-grabbing storyline, merging nostalgia and fantasy. The show ran for three seasons and all three were highly praised and heavily waited for. One obvious indication of the show's global success also reflects on the main characters' careers. Some of the boys landed roles in various films, such as Noah Schnapp, who plays Will Byers, who landed roles in Abe and Hubie Halloween. Same goes with Finn Wolfhard, playing Mike, who immediately landed a role in It 1 and 2 and The Addams Family. For the lead, Billy Bobby Brown, who plays Eleven, got lead roles in blockbuster movies such as Godzilla, King of Monsters, Godzilla vs. Kong, and Enola Holmes. So after last season's explosive finale, everyone went crazy for the release of Season 4. And while well, who could blame them? The last season's seventh episode showed Eleven losing her powers due to the Mind Flayer's bite and Hopper disappearing, basically a total cliffhanger. So what are the latest updates on the series' most awaited season four? Who is a part of the cast? Will Jim Hopper be back? Before we proceed, spoiler alert! From this moment on, this video will contain lots of spoilers, so if you haven't already, you might want to finish season three first. Let's now check out the first look on Stranger Things Season 4, but first, make sure to hit that subscribe button and smash that notification bell for more updates. Let's dig into it. Number 1. It's likely to be released in 2022 Stranger Things is unarguably one of the most anticipated series to be released this year in 2021, and fans are impatiently waiting. After the release of its last episode in 2019, fans around the world have been anticipating another season to be released as soon as possible to answer a lot of remaining questions. But most possibly due to the crazy world events, production might have been hindered, and as of the latest news, it is said that the show is currently in the process of filming the series. Although there is no official confirmation of a Stranger Things Season 4 release date yet, there has been some speculation that it will most likely be released by 2022. This latest news sprung out when actors Finn Wolfhart, Mike, and Noah Schnapp, Will, said so on their online meet-and-greet. When asked about the release of Season 4, Finn and Noah said that fans shouldn't expect a Season 4 until next year, which is very disappointing news. Noah also went on to say that principal photography might be completed by the summer, and then the season will be out. Also, when Netflix released a shareholder's letter for 2021, Stranger Things was nowhere to be seen. Well, at least it's safe to say that we can really expect the season to go out as early as next year, and we do hope it does. Number 2. New Characters Set In line with the announcement of the series' renewal for a fourth season, the original cast members are expected to return, which includes the main character's ensemble consisting of Winona Ryder as Joyce Byers, Millie Bombie Brown as Eleven slash Jane Hopper, Finn Wolfhart as Mike Wheeler, Dustin Matarazzo as Dustin, Caleb McLaughlin as Lucas, Noah Schnapp as Will Byers, Joe Keery as Steve Harrington, Natalia Dyer as Nancy Wheeler, Charlie Heaton as Jonathan Byers, Sadie Sink, who just appeared on Season 2 as Max, and Maya Hawke as Robin, a character who just recently surfaced in Season 3. The upcoming season also does not show any reason not to retain characters of Erica Sinclair, played by Priya Ferguson, the sister of one of the leads, Martin Brenner, the overarching antagonist referred to by Eleven as Papa, played by Matthew Modine, and Mike Wheeler's parents, Ted and Karen, portrayed by Joe Crest and Cara Buono, respectively. Brett Gelman, who portrayed Maury Bowman, a conspiracy theorist, has also leveled up to a series regular. Apart from this list of retained characters, the series also detailed the eight new faces joining the upcoming season, including Jamie Campbell Bower as Peter Ballard, whom you might know from Mortal Instruments, City of Bones. Joining him are Eduardo Franco, playing Jonathan's new best friend, Joseph Quinn, Robert Englund, Tom Washica, Sherman Augustus, Mason Dye, Nikola Jurichko, Tyner Rushing, and Joel Stauffer, 
Bauer, Franco, and Quinn's characters were added to the pool of main cast, while the others are set to appear throughout the season. Number 3. Hopper's Return Based on the previously laid out cast members list, we know you were hearing imaginary drum rolls while waiting for David Harbour's name to be called. David plays Chief Officer Jim Hopper, one of the main characters of the series who initially helped Joyce Byers to find her missing son and eventually adopted Eleven as his own daughter. As we all witnessed during the last episode of Season 3, Jim Hopper tried to fight the Russian Terminator while Joyce was stopping the machine. However, as Jim stood too close to the machine blasting towards the Upside Down's gate, he disappeared. Joyce ran to him but there was nothing left, and most fans presumed immediately that Hopper was dead. Eleven even read a heart-wrenching letter from her adoptive father too, which he wrote before the incident, and this made the disappearance of Hopper look more real and gloomy. Yet, before the finale's ending, a cliffhanger was shown after the credits where two Russian officers in a prison hallway were walking, choosing the cell of the next victim. When one of the soldiers pointed at a cell, the other soldier said, no, not the American. Theorizing based on the characters left at Hawkins, the only missing person points to Hopper, making many fans assume that Hopper is still alive and that Hopper is the American behind that cell's door. If you were one of the fans who waited long enough for the post-credits, then you might have had the same assumption. Fortunately, the upcoming season revealed that David Harbour will indeed go back to reprise his role, indicating that Jim Hopper is still alive. One other hint that the series dropped was in the teaser, where a 50-second video of men working above snowy grounds eventually focuses on one of our favorite characters, Jim Hopper. He is alive and he will be back. But what would be the premise of this seemingly darker new season? Number 4. Danger Escapes Hawkins As the main characters blew up a hole filled with demogorgons and eventually closed up the gate Eleven had opened up herself, we fans thought that the era of demogorgons was over. But then, the post-credits roll up and we see another one, apparently enclosed in a facility in Russia where Hopper is presumed to be taken to. According to the creators, the Duffer Brothers, the upcoming season will revolve around a new horror that is starting to surface in the States. Something long buried, something that connects everything, say the creators. They also announce that Hopper, dubbing him as the American, hinting about the last episode of season 3, will face dangers of both humans in nature and the other side of the gate. They also tease that the upcoming season is being built up to be the biggest and most frightening season yet, so perhaps there's a lot more for us to see. This build-up obviously tells us that it will surely be worth the wait, and knowing the Duffer Brothers from the last three seasons, we're pretty sure it will be. Despite the limited details officially announced to the public, fans can start theorizing through set photos like the ones showing something at Hawkins High School with military vehicles, a rundown trailer park, and a trailer home covered in tentacles, giving vibes of the upside down. Whatever we know so far, it's a good enough reason to celebrate that Stranger Things is coming back soon and it's coming back with Jim Hopper. That's all for today. Stay tuned for the next updates on Stranger Things Season 4 and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.